Hi everyone, Pocono Pam, and I wanted to show you my finished 3x4 mini inspired by Marion Smith on the Live with Prima show a couple of weeks ago. And I'll leave the link to the Ustream class, but it was called a 3x4 mini with tabs, something like that. And this is the one I'm making for Squeezy Mo, who is Michelle here on YouTube. She doesn't have any videos uploaded yet. However, I will put the link and you guys can, um, you know, stop by and say hello to her. She's all the way in Canada. Um, and if you haven't seen the goodies that she sent me for our bottle swap, you need to um, check that out. We were supposed to swap bottles, yes, but we decided to swap boxes instead only because she lives in Canada and we didn't want any issues of me sending a bottle across to another country like that. Um, this is the paper pad that I used. For the record, I think I misquoted last time what I used, but it is for the record. And I'm going to quickly go through this because my camera's been acting up and I think it's possessed. It's been changing my voice and everything. Um, if you don't recognize, this is the little umbrella man with um, by Tim Holtz. That's from the die cut, um, from the die. And I use that on the cover. This cover itself is from Capri Sun boxes and I use some postcards that I got for free at um, what do you call it? at Big Lots and then I just embellished it with some sorry it's all over the place with some Prima bling and I used some twine here and double knotted it um, just the first two pages this is a stamp that Linda who, you know what the heck Linda gave to me and it's a really it's a beautiful beautiful stamp that's not the full stamped image um, but I decided to stamp that on the tab because um, Michelle said she liked it and then just put an extra tab that I had right there and then every other page in the book has little quotes of inspiration for her all having to do with journey um, she's taking a personal journey right now, and I thought this little book would be a great inspiration, you know, just to have around in her purse, on her desk, on her night table, in the bathroom, wherever. <laughs> the kitchen table, in the car. Here are the next two pages. And as you see, each page has a pocket with a journaling tag that I left blank so that she can... um write ever what you know whatever she wants on there and on the opposite page I put like little mats where she can either <coughs> excuse me add additional embellishments or a picture so there's that this um I'm sorry Ruckus is outside fixing something oh boy um <laughs> yeah with our neighbors, so I don't know what's going on. Um, this is the little uh, alphabet flashcard, and I did emboss it with that um, the Tim Holtz embossing folder. I fell in love with this umbrella man because of um, the tube you you blah, 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 blah. the tube you master one, who's Patricia here on YouTube. Fell in love with that. I saw something she made with um, this little guy, you know, in the front. And the weathered clock, and it was just, I went out and got everything with this man on it. It's next page. Quick. Once again, matting here. And just, just a few embellishments on each page. And like I said, each page then has a little tab, which I um, cut out with my nest abilities. And I love these little tabs here. Just love it, love it, love it. This book is so cute and so easy to make. It's the next page and I'm also falling in love with the Lindy stamp gang spray this one I, um, these are flowers that I received in Iraq and I believe this is called the golden clump of coal or something like that. I'm not sure if you can see the nice shimmer on that flower but it's beautiful and just I love how that turned out Okay. Oh, this is absolutely my favorite quote. I would have um, read all of them, but they just take too long. But this is my favorite quote, quote, I can't speak this evening, of all. 
two roads diverged in a wood and I, I took the one less traveled by and that has made all the difference. Robert Frost. Love that quote. Love it. So I hope you guys are traveling on the road less traveled. Oh, love this stamp. Told you I went on and got everything that had to do with Timmy and this man. So that's from the Stampers Anonymous. And then this says, live the life you've imagined. And I wanted it funky like that, not a full stamp and grungy looking. And almost done. And the last page. What I did was I took the negative after I cut out the guy in the front. Um, used it as a mask and spritz some Lindsay Stamp Gang right there. So, and then that's just the back. It's really cute. Like I said, a three by four. Look at it compared to the, um, to the paper pack. So here's the paper pack. Here's the little guy. And this is a six by six pad. And that's a little book. So, Squeezy Mo Michelle, this is going out to you in the post tomorrow. I just wanted to share the, um, the vid and I kept messing up yesterday so I called Linda complained and put myself to sleep so everyone else thanks for taking a peek adios